accurate forecast in the Ozarks six years in a row. Well, you don't need me to tell you that it was cold outside today, but let me tell you how warm that we warmed up to this afternoon. We got to seven degrees here in Springfield, 10 down in Branson and 14 down in Fayetteville. Normally this time of year, we're supposed to be around 45. So we were well below average for this time of year. Fortunately for us, we are going to continue to trend warmer and warmer as we head into the next few days. But for now, it is cold. Six degrees here in Springfield West. Northwest winds at 14 miles an hour. We have the snow on the ground. It's looking like Christmas outside. But don't forget, turn on that humidifier because we have very, very dry air here at the surface. I know I'm going to be turning that humidifier on as soon as I get home because my sinuses will love me for it. Now, as we head in to the next several hours, you can see that we do have that wind chill advisory in effect for all of the Ozarks now until tomorrow at noon, and that's because wind chill values could be as low as negative 20. As we head into tonight, clear skies. As we head into tomorrow, 7 a.m., Christmas Eve it is. It is going to be a gorgeous day. Unfortunately, it's still going to be cold, so if you do have to do any shopping, last-minute shopping, or going to get some food or anything, you will need your biggest jacket once again. As we head into tonight, 1 degree here in Springfield, 2 up in Lebanon, and 4 over in Joplin. And then as we head into tomorrow, temperatures only warming up to a very cold 20 degrees here in Springfield. Luckily for us, it is going to be sunny and that sun really helps melt the, you know, ice, the snow that's on the roadways. And because it's so dry here at the surface, it actually evaporates as soon as it melts. So that's great news. We won't have too much problems on the roadways. 25 degrees down in Branson for you tomorrow. 26 in Harrison. That west wind, though, at 5 to 15 miles an hour, that's going to continue to make it feel very, very chilly throughout the day. But we get above the negatives above zero. This is 11 a.m. So most of the area is still below zero. As we head into the afternoon, you can see only topping out in those single digits, but I promise you those 50s are on the way as we head into later on next week. Also, I mean, this is perfect weather. This is what Santa lives in. So he is going to feel right at home here across the Ozarks. Maybe he won't want to leave. Temperatures tomorrow, 6 degrees as we head into the overnight hours. Mostly clear. It is going to be a frigid, frigid day on tap. And also, if your kiddos have maybe some presents that are going to going to be getting from Santa. 27 degrees is the high, so it is going to be a little bit chilly of a day, so make sure if they do want to go outside and maybe take that bike for a spin to have a big jacket on. 19 for an overnight low. Also, you did see snow possible as we head into Sunday night and into Monday. Here's 1 a.m. You're starting to see those snow showers and even a wintery mix as we head into our far northern counties. That's going to continue to transition into snow as we head into 4.30 a.m. And then those will continue to sink as we head into the morning hours. Here's our seven day forecast. Temperatures are going to be 34 degrees on Monday, but they're going to be decreasing throughout the day. 38 on Tuesday. That's the real day that we're going to be thawing out. Mm -hmm. And then 53 Wednesday, 58 though by Thursday. That's the day I'm looking at. Well, yeah, even Saturday and Sunday in the 20s, that's going to seem warm compared to today and yesterday. But I know we're looking forward to next week and we can maybe not break out the shorts, but it's going to feel